Hoosh and Otto Tatt moved on from the Blue Mountains Adel on the western coast of New South Wales not a Victorian border. The outskirts of Melbourne City to where? We reach Tassie. So we're looking around Devonport, begin our journey east. Through Port Sorrel, towards Launceston, inland through Ben Nurman National Park, Adel on the forest towards Derby. Led us to the east coast, the Bay of Fires, Wanglass Bay, a misty walk on the island, through to Port Arthur, and along to Hobart for a night view. And finally to Bruny Island for beach riding and a lighthouse tour with a Christmas Eve barbie. Christmas was upon us with the tinsel on my tent, but it was all over my bike as well. Awesome, it's Christmas. Have a happy, 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 merry Christmas. So Christmas is where I am right now. So awesome. Really excited. So yeah, let's get the day started. Happy Christmas. Look, Santa dropped me off a gift. Now it's time to spread the Christmas joy in the island. <laughs> oh, I just really needed a bunch of them. Oh, thanks for the Christmas gift. But before going on our ride for the day, we had a nice little brekkie next to the waterside. And I was trying to pedal along the dirt road in search of adventure. Playing the Christmas tune along the way. <laughs> Riding along to check out Simpson Bay. Then we made our way towards Adventure Bay to where we would have our Christmas lunch on the beach, tucked away on the cliffside.
there was a kid over there, a little kid about two years old, just sort of staring at me and going, <laughs> sort of thing. Panda, panda. So, mm. I came to this beach. Having my lunch and stuff and just chilling out. couldn't help ourselves. We had to jump into the water in our onesie Santa suit. Merry Christmas everyone, Merry Christmas and a happy new year. It's actually warm in this suit. <laughs> Not gonna lie, it's actually quite warm. This is nice. It's Christmas. It's Christmas. And of course, giving our family a nice call as we looked out oh. over the ocean. Where are you? Oh, just, just, just. My uh, my little Christmas lunch I had set up and never singing. Well, that was a nice chat with my uh, family then. That was really good. Three o'clock, they're just all getting fed and just, uh, yeah, having our usual late, late uh, Christmas lunch and opening presents back at home all the way. That's uh, 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 so funny. So, a few times people will be like, oh, it's Santa because I got my uh, Santa onesie on and the kind of. I like it when it sort of makes a smile. It makes me smile as well when people say that. It's kind of cool. Like those people who are there swimming and stuff. They <laughs>
After chilling at the beach for a few hours, we made our way back up to a lawn. The sun was slowly setting. We would run into Peter, who is walking around Tassie with all the gear in his car. Um. Well. Uh, after I met. After I met you, I went on. I saw some Christmas around too. Hey, it's good. It's good. Yeah. Yeah, town's closed today though. Yeah, yeah. But now even the pubs not open. Yeah, no. It's amazing because pubs are open. A lot of places in Australia and the pubs have always been open on a Sunday. Yeah? Mm. Uh, on a Christmas uh, day. Mm. Are they earlier on in the morning they're not, but later on in the afternoon they open up. Mm. But not here. Uh, how long are you staying? Um, I'm heading off tomorrow. Oh yeah? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm just going to go and put my tent up up near those, uh, you know, where the uh, boat club is. Oh, yeah. So with, uh, okay. with my, there's two numbers on there. I'm going to ring one of them. Later. Oh, yeah. Look so, uh, at where you did it. You I was got my stuff right back there. Yep. Um, but, yeah. yeah. Nobody bothered you? No. no. Yeah, likewise. I stayed at the Rookery on the, on the, the, the uh, Isthmus. Oh, yeah. The, uh, the Truganini Lookout. Yeah, 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 yeah. And, uh, yeah, so after dark, red lights, uh, at wait pretty late, uh, see the penguins come out of the surf. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Across and, and then all the mutton birds as well. The, uh, yeah. The seal and the sheer water. Uh, when I, I, I camped, I camped up the toilet. And in the morning, about 10 past four, I could start to hear this noise. At first, I thought it was a big level of piss off. But there's thousands of these chicks. Oh, wow. And they're all getting ready to go back out to sea again to get more food in there. Yeah. It's a way to make a living. And the, the good thing about it is that, is that like yourself, you you do adventure, work, adventure, work. Is that yeah. basically your life? Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's how I want to try and do more, yeah. That's how mine is. And, I'm enjoying it. Yeah. So after that great chat, we headed to cook up our dinner feast on the local barbecues and have a Christmas dinner with my parents, virtually. <laughs> Just, uh, oh, wow. Where yeah. Are you? You're barbecue. Uh, yeah, still, uh, still white. Yeah. Little family call. <laughs> okay, Josh, you can turn the computer sideways. I even went to, I went to a barbecue yesterday, actually. Oh, you did go to that barbecue that I, the pictures that I brought up in Strava. Um, what do you call an elephant that flies? A flying... Oh. Mm. A jumbo. <laughs> but yeah. So are they alright? Uh, I hope so, yeah. yeah. Are you it up for them? Yeah. Yeah, we know. 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 Yeah, Which included rice, bread, tuna, soup, and whatever else I had in my food bags.
This is how you spend Christmas with your family when you're on a bike trip. They were, they're there at home. I usually would be around this time, and I'm here at this barbecue thing. I was at a beach earlier, but yeah. Watch out. Just turning around. Oh. Careful! There's little Morty! Oh, there's little Morty! <laughs> Did you get him? Yeah. Oh. Oh, what's that light you've got on that? That's my GoPro. Oh, right. Oh, no, 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 I hadn't ordered them. So I got these little ones. Oh, yeah. They're oh. strong. Oh, no. Yeah, I just got the fire that's over there. It's never crossed the the dam or whatever it's yeah, called. It's pretty well <laughs> Thanks for chatting. Josh will say goodbye. Mm -hmm. Josh! There it is. Bye, Simon. See ya. <laughs> Thanks for the chat. Thanks for the chat. It was great. Yeah, I enjoyed it. Yeah. And have an, have an awesome birthday tomorrow. I wish you had a birthday now and, and tomorrow. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, and we'll try and we'll try and have another chat in uh, New Year's. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Uh, awesome. So that was great fun. Just had an hour and fifty chat with my my mom, my dad, my brother, my cat. Well, some of them, and uh, just talked about my whole trip and just had a great Christmas. We brought, we all had our. They had their Christmas dinner at the table. I had my Christmas dinner at this barbecue and also out on this lawn. See, uh, but it was just a great, just a great to catch up. And they also rang earlier when I was at the beach, and uh, yeah, it was just a great, awesome catch up. So I, I would count this as one of the most memorable Christmases I've had. Where I was just, I woke up singing Christmas tunes. I played my Christmas music. Had my nice breakfast, went for a ride, and just went to the beach. Had a, had a nice, nice Christmas. So this has been an awesome Christmas. So I hope everyone had a great Christmas, even though you, when you're watching this video, it's probably like a few months ago. But uh, yeah, so good stuff. Now we've got to pedal on, pedal on back to our campsite because I uh, wanted to set up a camp, leave my gear, and yeah, the campsite is just a 40 minute ride away. But uh, yeah, but we'll be once we get back there, we'll be all snug, all good to go. So after that great Christmas dinner, it was time to say goodbye, and then a ride back along the dirt roads to be good old little hut. Wow, what a different Christmas that was! It was me, my bike on this island, and a few phone calls, and a nice pedal around. Well, that was a good Christmas day. It's good fun, good bike ride, good talk to the family, and a good night ride as well. Right for dark, so yeah. I'll catch you in the morning. Awesome. Day 53 was beginning, so it was time to head along the beach for a ride alongside the ocean for Brecky.
That's a nice little morning breakfast. I'm gonna have a, I got my cereal, I got my water, I got that, and I got the view. And also, it's my mum's birthday today on Mox Day. So, happy birthday to her, big birthday to her. I'll send her a personal message for you. And of course, a dip into the water. Really enjoy. Have a little tough moment, just look up and go, you know what? I can be happy here and just stay positive and just be you and uh, do you and then just trying to pack up our gear, pack it all onto our bike, and then hit the road. Ready. And ride along the dirt. Go through the dirt. Uh, looks like I've got a bit of a flat tire here. Oh no. That's not good. Check there, I've already top off, and, which isn't uh, so, so annoying. Um, but hopefully, after that, we'll go get the boat across and back. We turn towards Adventure Bay and search those lost bike keys. Okay, see if we can find these keys. We looked along where we were yesterday, still couldn't find it there. A note that I'm going to put on a couple, couple places, so, yep, and on the plus side, we uh, did that. Then we made our way towards the rough waters on the beach for a nice swim. So I've travelled from uh, New South Wales, yep. Australia, and uh, with Victoria, got the boat across, and then Ooh. sort of going around Tassie. Nice. Yeah. 
Otherwise, it's quite a bit of excess. Yeah. You know, we're trying to pack light and then something here. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. So where are you headed now? Um, headed probably uh, back towards towards Hobart to see like the boats coming from the city. Yeah, sweet. Yeah. We've got another fun on that back tyre. <laughs> so the pumps of stuff works. Yeah, it should be all good, hopefully. So yeah, we, we repaired another tyre which had a damage to it. I couldn't find the, the this one, so I had another tyre which had a damage to it. I found the hole on that one, so I fixed that. We pedaled back along, making our way to the boat back across the main passage. We were tired of shoes as the sun was slowly going down. We reached the dock, where the cars were waiting to get on. Awesome. Yep, there's the boat. We to the boat, but I think it's the last one across, so... Uh... And we almost could have spent another time here, but uh, we'll go across and we'll probably hopefully ride on for a bit and hopefully if there's any more issues with that beer, we'll try and ride on for another hour and a half, two hours and see where we get to. We reached the dock where the cars were waiting and there was not long to wait before it was ready to hop on. On the boat we got, as the waves hitting against the side, we made the 30 minute journey back across the Tassie. So on the boat we got, as the waves were hitting the side, we moved along through the water, making the 30 minute journey to Kettle. Once back on land, we rode along the road, the golden sunshine slowly going down.
So I don't know if you can see me. Um, so we're about five k's out of where I was trying to go tonight because we were just and then it's that small little thing that we're trying to find the other to go to go to that camp and go in the morning. So tire was going all good. So I think five k's out. That's the issue of the tire. Well, so I can't really pump up the tire. So we're five k's out, so I must have to a bit dark, but I'll. We've got a quick snack from Mac. Figure out a spot to camp. Our nice ice cream sundae. Yep, just a nice little spot to rest up for a <laughs> house in the wetlands. Uh, yeah, nothing fancy. We had our Sunday ice cream after another awesome day mm. of adventure. Good stuff. Next time on Oz Tats, we fix up our wheel in Hobart Town, where we meet a few cyclists and have an adventure around Hobart, seeing the boats come in, in a view of Tassie from the mountains. Don't forget, adventure is just outside your door.